Hey Science Seekers, this is Mr. Pfeiffer. We're actually on a walk with Hubble the dog today. And we are at the old Schomburg Center. This is a wetland wildlife preserve since 1990. It's right in the corner if you're familiar with Schomburg and uh, Roselle Road over here. There's an Oberweiss right back here. And uh, then there's this little wetland hiding here. And the reason we're here today is to talk about this plant in front of this wetland. This is called the sumac. The sumac is a very popular shrubbery it's it's a tree but it doesn't get very tall this is probably about as tall as it can get you can see there's some oak trees right behind me here um but the sumac is pretty important to these areas because it does provide some shade you know for those shade tolerant type of plants and then it has this beautiful thing happening right here this is a fruit and the fruit comes from the flower this plant is not poisonous but there's a version of this plant called poison sumac now this plant was used by the Native Americans to make tea. Um, poison sumac is not good. It's related to poison ivy and poison oak. And that is not one that you would want to. They actually have white flowers and white berries. Where regular sumac has these red berries that are just starting to form. Remember, from flower comes fruit. And this is the fruiting bodies of the sumac tree. See you guys in the next episode of Side Seekers. Peace out.